Hey, what is up, guys? Wicked95 here, back with another video. Welcome to Wicked's Action Figure Reviews, and today I am back with Figure of the Week. Uh, this one's number 18 already. If you guys didn't check out all the other Figure of the Weeks, go check them out. This is a series where we just uh, take a look at a specific figure, um, and we just talk about it, of you know, the box, what you got with it and everything, price, what it's going for, uh, things like that, you know, some some little facts here and there. But uh, today we have the Keith Lee Elite Series 82. I picked this up at like Fred Meyer in a buy one get one half off or a buy one get one free. Don't remember what exactly uh, deal I got there. But I got this one in the Elite 82 Finn Balor. Uh, which is the one I still use. I was looking for another of this Keith Lee. Never got it. And uh, honestly I never used it in my Fig Fed. So I never had the need to open it. Um, I do have the Survivor Series one, so if I did want it to open it, I would probably open, excuse me, the Survivor Series one since it's a little bit less rare than this one, in my opinion. I don't know if you can still get it at ringside, um, but if you can't, I saw it online reselling for like 35 on this one. And he does have a Chase version, which I do have. Uh, I did manage to uh, acquire that one as well uh, for retail, so I'll show you guys here in a bit. But here we have Elite Series 82 Kit Lee. He did came with interchangeable hands and the uh, jacket or the hoodie vest, headed hooded vest there. Black attire looks pretty dope. Keith Lee right here on the on the sides, a certified authentic uh, old style packaging. I feel like this packaging we we got it like not too long ago and now we changed it again. Um, Keith Lee wearing that gear, all the stats and information there. Uh, and there's the others in the line, like I said. Uh, Finn Balor, I do have this John Morrison as well. I never got any of those uh, other figures, which I did want that Rob Gronkowski for the 24-7 championship and the Alexa Bliss for the women's tag team. Uh, I think this and the R-Truth are the only two figures that come with an 24-7 uh, championship. So it's becoming a little bit more rare, so I might try to find that. Maybe Ringside still has it, I don't know. But... Keith Lee, I think uh, the head scan is is somewhat all right. It's not, you know, perfect, but it looks pretty cool. Uh, I like the whole gear. Now, like I said, I did go into Fred Meyer and just uh, had to go get some stuff and you know went to the toy section um, because in my in my area there's two Fred Meyers and the one uh, closer to me uh, didn't doesn't have a, a big selection of toys um, and. In the figure section, they don't have a wrestling section at all. And uh, one of the other ones that I go to has a figure section. Uh, and for the longest time, they never updated it. It was I always went. It was the same thing, uh, basics and a couple of elites here and there that weren't really you know my interest. And then all of a sudden, they got uh, Elite 82, and they had a buy one get one like half off or buy one get one free or something like that with card or whatever. And I picked it up. I got both of them. I basically paid like 19. 19.99 at the time for both uh, Because I got the other one for free I think or I got a half off I paid like 10 bucks for it either way I got it for a steal because now this is worth basically the two figures in my opinion But we will take a look at it He does have the chase version the the one with the like a uh, whitish pants Gear with the pink same thing except the, the gear just changes. This is the chase version I think that one's like $50 online right now. Uh, you can get that right there. I don't know if I'm going to sell mine soon. Uh, and if I were to, I'd probably sell them both in a package deal. Or, um, I don't know, maybe open that uh, Elite Series 82 Keith Lee. Um, I don't really need it in my collection though right now. Like in my uh, Fig Fed, I meant. Uh, but I don't really have a need for him right now. So, if I were to, like I said, I'll pick up the Survivor Series but. Let me know what you guys think of this Keith Lee. If you guys have it, if you guys picked up the chase. Uh, I know this is the 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 chase that, that was very sought after. I know a lot of people wanted it online. The pink and, and, and like grayish, whitish. I don't know what to call that. Cream or off-white color. Uh, but then when I got it, I was super hyped. I wish we would have gotten the double jointed uh, elbows by then. But, you know, we're getting there. So Keith Lee is no longer in WWE. Uh, he is in AEW, but maybe they'll pump a, a Keith Lee later on for the AEW figures. 
maybe I'll get that one. I'm not sure. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure to follow my Instagram for uh, all the updates and uh, fig basically all my 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 toy uh, um, mail calls or fig hunts, however you want to call them, like things that I pick up on stores. Uh, like recently, I picked up the Jay Uso, uh, Jimmy Uso from Walmart, and that went up on my Instagram. So go check it out. Um, there's a giveaway coming at 500. I already hit 400 subs. So make sure to go subscribe. Make sure to go like, comment, share the video so we can get there, guys. It's going to be an epic. You don't want to miss it. I'll see you next time.